obviously I had to talk about, but I think that, that that's really enough in this. Like, we have this this time. And I, again, service to God, or basically the Godhead, supreme being, which is ourselves, or service to King, the actual externalized world and all of what it's been developing in order to say that it's sustaining us, when really it's not. And thus an immortal being can be made to forget and that they're immortal. And if people don't think that that's possible, then look at yourself. <laughs> and that's all I have to say to people. As long as it takes them to realize that is as long as I'll be here. And so, again, I want to say wholeness and balance vibration. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and, and um, take the line. Okay, thank you. And that's going to be it today for everyone. Obviously, we got through a lot there, and it's just a massive stuff going on. As I said, I wanted to take a moment to collect information. Obviously, it's a lot, but it can be simplified. And I always, I said something this other day, and I'll, and I'll leave everyone with this thought, that sometimes it's just based on how you're explaining it. And if it's something that's really complex and you're not really good at explaining it, it takes a person a long time to comprehend it. But what we're actually talking about is relatively simple. So if we've gotten into complex ways of explaining it, then we have to come up with some other system if we're expecting people to be able to grasp it. You need to have something for parents and children because you can get to the parents through the children and you can get to the children through the parents. But understand, they're understanding in this galaxy, what appears to be happening to me is that, that what's ever generated on this moon is getting to our parents through us. Meaning that it's almost like we are hostages or hosts here. That something is feeding off of us. We have all this power, but we can't connect to it. And it's in between. Something in between us and our magnificent selves. So, in all of what I've discovered, it leads me to that. It says, there was a disconnection of breaking the chain. One chakra is down, or some type, of, some type of synthetic chakra is there. Some bad data, then. I said, some bad data, then? <laughs> like, I, I decrypt it. Because the, the, the spirit loves to be vainglorious. It loves to interweave the whole story. Yes, great stars and meteors landing down. <laughs> Are you talking about just minerals for building blocks? You see, this is how dull we've gotten. So what I'm saying is, is that this is the quest. This is the adventure, the innerverse. It contains danger, peril, success, happiness, good endings. That's why I encourage people to get on the adventure because that's what really powers you. So I want to say wholeness and balance vibration to everyone. Thank you for tuning in to AfterQuest. Again, we will be actually continuing next month. I believe that's actually on the, let me get the date for everyone. That'll be August, excuse me, not August. That'll be July. Oh boy. <laughs> All right. All right, it's not allowed. Computers quit, so. <laughs> but it'll be in July, so we'll, uh, you know, everyone will see bulletins. Also, we're probably going to be doing some stuff in between then, especially since we'll have some major video creations going on then. Probably some sneak peeks. Another announcement was Resistance lost its Vimeo. Unfortunately, Vimeo could not handle the level of consciousness in which we were bringing, so they, and they chose to desist. And uh, so anyone looking for those videos, they will be resourced onto the YouTube channel so you can look out for some of the stuff that you would normally find on the Vimeo there. So again, wholeness and balance vibration. I'll be talking to you soon.